Yeah, uh, YouTubers, Tazman here, bringing you another episode of Tazcraft. Yeah. Uh, so in the last episode, we did a whole bunch of talking. I mean, a lot of it. And hopefully, you found what we talked about of uh, value. Um, I've done quite a bit more up there. I can't remember. I think this has grass in it. No, it has a whole lot of nada in it. <laughs> has nothing. Um, but yeah, anyway, I've been doing some work up there, leveling it and making it look a little nicer. Um, and I think, so let's just go up. It looks like Astro Storm just went to bed, so we don't need to make sure it's day. But you'll see, I also have this giant square right there. And because this is my area down here, I was thinking, you know, that'd be kind of suiting to do a kind of face of me maybe right there and that's going to be Taz Manor up there if we have time to make it. Um, so that is a couple other things. So I did post to the other Taz crafters in uh, the discord, our discord, um, about well when 114 comes out do we want to do a world reset? Uh, because we've actually got a lot of new Taz crafters that are kind of just waiting um, we have some from like the Mind Fighter um, SMP. So we have Sabrina, Dykick, and Tian Tian. Um, I think that's how it says his name. Uh, we have them. And then, of course, like I've said before, you know, anyone is welcome to join this server that meets the minimum requirements that you can find on my. I think I put it. Was it in the Minecraft forum? Yeah, maybe I'll try and remember. I'll put that link down. Why am I pointing down? <laughs> down there, um, underwater, uh, we will be... I'll, I'll have the re minimum requirements. I know I've mentioned it many, many times what they are. You know, you basically have to be an active YouTuber with at least 10 Minecraft videos on your channel with that are 10 minutes or longer with you commentating in them. Uh, also, I... I just have to use an age restriction. I know a lot of people are kind of bummed about that. Um, uh, you, I really want you to be at least 17 or more. Um, I do have some Taz crafters on here that kind of slipped through that rule, maybe because I know the person for a long time, um, such as Wintry. Uh, you know, I've I've known him since the early early days. Uh, so you know he finally he he wasn't like 13 or anything I think I think he's 15 maybe 16 right now so we went ahead and let that slide but hey I own the server I reserve that right I can do that is that cool yeah that's cool uh, but anyway so what I want to do is kind of do some prep work for this guy right here and for it we're gonna want we have a bunch of birch wood which uh, I think was a birch. no I just use oak that's fine uh, but some things we're gonna need and I'm not exactly sure because this is like twice the size that I've ever made it um, but I found you know I've, I've had the hardest time trying to figure out something that kind of matches this color right here this kind of reddish brown color and I finally was uh, on another server uh, cake craft and I found a block that I didn't think of using before that actually matches it pretty nicely and that is the note block um, and I think we could either use the note block or I think the jukebox has the same texture. Does it, can we see them in here? Note. No. Showing all. Show everything. Come on. Show me a note block. Darn it. Well, maybe, we'll, we'll, maybe I'll just have to make both of them, I guess. Um, so let's go ahead and do this real quick. Let's go back down. So I think either the note block or the jukebox. Now I'm trying to think. I think the note block might be a little bit easier to make. Do I have any redstone? Oh, there's there's one. So I think isn't the note block just basically um, this and a redstone at the bottom? No. <laughs> Darn it. Um. Well, maybe if I have this in here and I type note block, it'll come up now. There it is. So the note block. Oh, okay. So it's a full thing so that's that 
that's pretty easy to make and we should be able to do that pretty easily uh, the jukebox I think is a little bit more complex Ju, there's the jukebox right there but we can't make that is a diamond in the middle so I think we want to go with the note blocks I need to make a lot of these which means a lot of people are going to be playing my head, I'm sure. They're going to go out there and do, 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 do. Although I don't know what sound does a note block make if it has a... Where's my redstone? I know I have a bunch in maybe a ch in one of these. Dude, I thought I had so much redstone. <laughs> Where's all my redstone? That's my, that's my end box. These... Diamond helmet. That's my getting my I died box. Got a lot of fireworks. Enchanted book. That's for Mikey. Did I take it? I know I have a bunch of redstone somewhere. Did I take it to? It might. No, this is the end box, so it's not in there. It could be in this one. And maybe like a stack would be plenty, but uh, we're going to want some white concrete. Either, should I do obsidian? Maybe obsidian I think would be good for the eyes and nose. Um, it could also be, why well, I got flowers? I never collect flowers. Well, yeah, apparently I do collect flowers. I got a bunch of heads in there. Oh, redstone. Perfect. Okay, let's maybe take out... Boy, I need to go mining. I thought I had way more redstone than that. <sighs> All right. Well, that should give us eight times nine. Yeah, that that's plenty. I think. I, to be honest, I really don't know. Uh, then if we go here and do this, is that that should be. Oh boy, <laughs> that's only eight. Um, wow. Uh huh. Bam. So there's thirty one of those. So I think let me just think really quick. So for my uh, let's go look here at me. So there's like a two gap there. I believe and then we do four six and eight now if we double those we have four uh, eight wait no four twelve and sixteen sixteen and twelve that's twenty eight and four is thirty two two is that, is that right and we're we got one <laughs> we're we're missing come on we got wood somewhere i always have wood and i don't well, i might have wood downstairs actually now that i'm thinking about it so anyway like i was saying the consensus oh not very much 33 uh, the consensus is kind of leaning towards, yes, we want to do a world reset. Um, we even have some Taz crafters that joined originally, but due to various circumstances, they were unable to actually, oh, wait, oh, I'm thinking wrong. It's even going to be more. It's going to be six. It's going to be a full stack because so. So when I'm doing this, just as the eight that means like that would be like one pixel right but now that I'm doubling it in size that is one pixel so it's actually gonna take 64 note blocks and I probably want an axe to do this do, do. what sound do these make if there's nothing under them what do they make if they so they do make I guess people are gonna be playing my head all the time <laughs> it's gonna be funny um, well for as long as the server goes anyway so like I said um, 
that the consensus does seem like maybe we will uh, go ahead and reset the server. Um, and but I'm I want all the task crafters to weigh in. And this is also one other thing I wanted to do is you know for for the future when we're we're getting new task crafters on here, I would like the other task crafters to weigh in too because right now. You know, I tried to do it a little bit at first. We have plenty. Um, where where they would weigh in and say, yeah, go ahead and let this guy on. I checked out his channel. It looks pretty good, blah, blah, blah. And I kind of had a hard time getting, you know, like I wanted to get back with the person that was trying to get on as soon as I could. And I couldn't get the task crafters to answer quick enough. So I was thinking you know maybe there might be a week turnaround from the time that someone says hey I'd like to join and here's my channel I meet the requirements you know um, I'll have the other task crafters check it out as well and then we'll let me just it's probably night by now we'll uh, want to uh, have everyone check it out active task crafters by the way <laughs> um, there, there's gonna be a lot of changes I think with the internal structure of Tazcraft and how how it works and stuff but anyway maybe we'll just go over here real quick since I don't have even half the blocks I need for the the <laughs> top of my head uh, let alone the concrete I'm gonna need I'm gonna have to go I've been trying like I, I don't like hello oh crud oh no 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 uh, can we get us a, that'd be awesome oh go That'd be awesome if we could get another trident. Boy, this guy. Why can't I swim fast? Okay, I gotta sneak up behind him because I have no armor. And, oh, don't want to go up there. No, no, no. Um, why can't I swim fast? I thought I had... Oh, I don't have anything, do I? I'm thinking of a different server that I'm on that I can actually uh, have some of that stuff. I don't have anything on me right now. So I don't know this this is really stupid. I don't know where he went. Yeah, I don't have any armor on. This this does not seem like a good idea at all. I'm imagining he was chasing me. So I'm gonna get up over here. And just chuck that and hopefully I don't think that was very far oh we're stuck please oh geez you scared me squiddy okay he he might be like over there oh. okay Whew. I would have liked the trident because I did lose mine and this okay good I was thinking this is gonna be pointless because I'm gonna have to go back down but um, I think I totally lost track of what I was talking about I just want to show you what I've done up here so I've been filling in some of the dirt and stuff um, so that uh, we can have a nice flat area to build on somewhat not not a ton so as you can see I'm thinking what we want to have maybe here is like I said this will still be like where the bedroom is with a balcony off the side uh, this was kinda looking at block types what do we want to make it out of colors and such but I would like to maybe throw down this box or are you empty too you're empty too maybe I'll throw down this box actually no I was gonna give I think that's a gift <laughs> I'm gonna give that for uh, Dykit if he when he gets on so I'm gonna put these no blocks in there for now because that's gonna be for the giant Taz head which is right here it's gonna be big you're gonna be able to see it from space I doubt it but that'd be cool um so yeah anyway uh, this will be the room and then like right here is going to be a wall and then I kind of wanted like a a curve just so it's not just a bunch of straight lines like a nice little curve here that'll probably be glass and then here will be the entrance 
we'll probably have like a walkway that comes out in front here and then just kind of uh, goes over that way and then kind of spirals down but we don't want to get in front of the Taz face uh, but just kind of spirals or zigzags down until you're basically at the bottom then I'll have like a little dock where you can get in a boat and go to the ugly <laughs> timeshare or whatever you want to call it over there uh, and then I was thinking like you come in here and this would be the main area we go here um, and then there would be like a little step down and then there'd be like this little area here that might be kind of built into this so we might take it back a little further here but you'll have a nice little window like or balcony coming off right here or something and then that cow just spawn then over here might be where we have a secret door that goes down to the um, whatever's below us now I was remember how I was like oh yeah uh, so what I could do is I come I go down there and then I go this way and then I go this way and then I take a really long path and then the other long path and I end up here it's actually opposite cuz so when we go inside here uh, the ladder is on this back wall which means we actually go this way then this way then this way and then this way so we're actually probably a lot closer to under the village so whatever we have under here uh, you know for a little secret layer type thing where we have our our fun stuff um, I don't know what it is yet so I guess we'll find out for all I know it might I mean this mine shaft that's over here it could actually span all the way over here so far it's been ginormous huge so who knows maybe it actually does connect maybe there's a cave system or a ravine or something that connects over there I don't know we'll find that out when we get to that part and making our secret area or maybe we won't maybe Tazcraft will uh, go away before then or not go away but this it'll go to season two we'll find out so anyway those are kind of the plans I'm just gonna keep plugging away whether this goes away or not it's gonna be valuable uh, building experience for me which I desperately need so either way whether uh, I don't finish it or you know we move on to something else bigger and better things before then it's not a big deal I'm still going to just keep plugging away until the very day I say all right we're starting a new map uh, oh that's one other thing I did I actually there was an island right there a little thing that came up um, I leveled it and put it down so that you'd be able to even see the Taz head from our little <laughs> our little aquarium over there so pretty cool all right so let's see what can we do in this episode now that I don't have enough of these darn note blocks so the the task that I'm gonna do I don't know I've never done it in a video before I don't think so I do think that it's going to be kinda 3d it's not just gonna be kinda like a pixel art that's just completely flat it'll actually I believe come out like at least two pixels for the head and then the snout will maybe go out another two pixels and I was thinking out of the the mouth of Taz um, because it'll actually be like a four or a two pixel high gap I might have a balcony so I might even have like maybe a spot where I can get in there and just look out from inside my mouth seems pretty cool right so there we go I think that's it uh, we only have like a minute left before we're at the 20 minute mark so I think I'm gonna end it here uh, if you have well I guess it'll be too late when we see this video but one thing I wanted to mention um, that I'm going to probably start doing is uh, at the end of this video uh, there will be a like 10 minute video where I'm talking about the game giveaway for 1000 games I'm actually showing all the games so be sure to stick around and then I'm also showing other games like I have in my uh, humble bundle library I probably have at least oh I'd say 
maybe close to 100 games in there. And I was thinking, you know, maybe I should do like a monthly giveaway. And it would be something to encourage you to watch whole videos. So I wouldn't say, oh yeah, be sure to watch at the end of this video for details on to how to win or something. In fact, it would be completely covert. You have to earn it. It's kind of a challenge for you guys. What you end up having to do is watch a whole video. Oh no, not watch a whole video <laughs> from start to finish. Because I might just be in the middle of a video and say, hey, by the way, if you are the first person to... Uh, say rubber baby buggy bumpers in the comment you win a game so it'll be something really simple like that it won't be a game where you get to choose it it'll just be a game that I'm just going from my my humble bundle list but I think that'd be kind of fun and you get a game in you know so I think that's pretty cool right so that's it I'm gonna go ahead and close because I'm rambling on um, well we made note blocks so Look, uh, well, we don't even have... We made no blocks in this episode. In the next episode, I'm going to try and gather up all the different resources we need to make the Taz face. Because I think that's going to be really pretty cool looking once it's done. It'll be this full size right here. I'm kind of looking forward to that. Um, but that's it. Uh... If you like this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up down below. Aside from that, comment, like, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. Check out my Discord and my other channels. Don't forget about the great big game giveaway. Of course, you won't be able to do that because right after this, as soon as I say, until next time, uh, we're actually going to have another little clip where it, hopefully I remember to do that now, uh, where I actually show off all the games and we, we do uh, just some talking about my giveaways. So, yeah, that's it. So, like I said, check out my discords. Uh, tell everyone you know about my channel. Uh, we can get to that 1,000. We're halfway there. Hit 500. I think I'm actually, as of this recording, like 508. So, very awesome. Grab a drink real quick. And, yeah, so then, anyway, that's it. Um, I... I think I've said everything, so all we have left is until next time, I'll be seeing you later. Bye. Hey, yeah, YouTubers, Tazman here. Actually, you know what? I don't need to say that. Because <laughs> I'm probably going to be sticking this at the end of videos because it's just going to be short. But I'm here anyway. And, uh,. I just wanted to show you guys, I've, I've been saying this for a while, I've been saying, yeah, I have like 57 Steam games I'm going to be giving away, and if you want to know what they are, I read the list, blah, 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 and it could be really easy to not believe, for one, that I have 57 Steam games, or what those Steam games are, and I keep saying I did some video a while ago where I read them off, but as you can see, I'm a gamer. Uh, if you look here, 519 Steam games. If we go over here to my uh, Steam library inventory, this is where the 57 Steam games that I'm going to be giving away are. And as you can see, each of these rows has five games. So we'll just kind of go through these really quick. And there's about three and a half pages, I guess, because what is that? This is 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Actually, it'd be four and a half pages, basically. So anyway, as you can see, I have two copies of Seven Days to Die, Alien, Colonial Marines, two of those. I have three of these Castle Miner uh, Z. I have three Castle Storms. I have uh, one Counter-Strike Global. I've given these away. I had like four... I probably had about eight of these things, and I've been giving away in the past uh, quite a bit. Uh, but anyway, one of the ca uh, CS goes, which is the Global Strike, uh, glo glo Counter Strike Global Offensive. I have one copy of Dig and Die. This one is a Steam gift that actually is Divinity Original Sin, and it actually has four items. It has Beyond Divinity, uh, the classic. Uh, an enhanced edition and I'm missing one in there. Oh divine divinity and beyond divinity I guess is one of them uh, So anyway, there's four basic games in there, but it's just one uh, I also have don't starve together 
with, I guess, the new character, Wartok, which I don't know anything about. I have two copies of Doom BFG Edition. Uh, these ones actually include the entire Doom series, including Doom 3. So that's pretty cool. Does that mean they even included... Yeah, the entire series. Uh, I have two copies of Dragon's Dragon Age Ultimate Edition Origins. One Edge of Space... Uh, two fight the dragon, two FTL, uh, one of gauntlet. Now I don't think I think all of these sort together. I'm not sure if we'll run into another gauntlet somewhere else. But oh well, we'll just say one gauntlet for now. One gem crafting craft gem craft. Yes. Um, hold on, I need to uh, scroll down just a little bit. Actually, I don't want to go that far. About right there. Uh, I have one human resource machine. Uh, if you've seen my Let's Play of that, it's a great game. Uh, one Interstellar Marines. One Left 4 Dead Game of the Year Edition. One Left 4 Dead 2. Um, yeah, I was just making sure it's only Left 4 Dead 2. One Meridian New World. One Move or Die, which is also a really fun game. Three Planet Explorers. And then I have Portal and Portal 2, and another Portal and Portal 2, so you get both those games. So, technically it's still 57 games because you can't split those up, but you can get Portal and Portal 2. Uh, one Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Vegas, one Resident Evil Revelations, two Shadowrun Returns, which is a really fun TBS type game. Uh, one Sniper Elite 2, hello? One Sniper Elite 2. Uh, then I also have Sniper Ghost Warrior Gold Edition, uh, which is the base, and two DLCs. So it's basically Sniper Ghost Warrior, uh, Ghost Warrior, Sniper Ghost Warrior Map Pack, and Sniper Ghost Warrior Second Strike. So a lot of games there. Three Space Engineers, which is a pretty fun game. Three Terraria. Uh, one Toki Toki. Toki Tori 2 Plus, uh, one Tomb Raider, hello, one Tomb Raider, uh, this is the first one of the remake, the origin story of Lara Croft, we have two Torchlight 2s, we have three Tower Wars, we have two copies of XCOM Enemy Unknown, um, oh that's it I guess, wait, did I count that wrong? Hold on. Because this is uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Oh, yeah. So it'd be two. I said four and a half. And that's 50. And there's 51, 52, 53, 54, 5, 56, and 57. Then I have these, but these aren't a big deal. These are just things. So as you can see, there are 57 Steam games. Now, um, if worse comes to worse, I guess. I even have more games because I bought lots of other games on like uh, on the uh, whatchamacallit origin not origin the GOG thing hold on a second I'll pull up that list <laughs> so I will see you in a minute okay so we're back as you can see we have Tasman's game giveaway list these are I think all the ones we went through there might be a couple others I don't know if we had that up maybe that's 57 but oh humble bundle did I say GOG? I think I did GOG too. But as you can see here, I have just boatloads of other ones. Now some of these are, like these are the Steam games through Humble Bundle that I bought. Um, and I guess there's some pretty good ones here. I don't know. Uh, Fear 2, Fear 3, Lord of the Rings, uh, Scribble Nuts Unlimited, Batman Arkham City, Arkham Origins, Fear, I guess I have Fear 1, 2, and 3. I actually have two of those, two of those, two of those. So, I mean, I have plenty of games to be giving away as as prizes on my channel. In fact, I might, I don't know, maybe I'll even start doing like a monthly thing. Because these are just going to get older and older. And eventually people aren't even going to want them. And I just have them. I, I just have them. i got to get rid of them at some time. So, and then I also have some Origin games too. Dead Space, Burnout, Crisis, Medal of Honor, Mirror's Edge, 
Command and Conquer, Red Alert 3, Uprising, Unpopulous. So as you can see, Tasman has games coming out of his ears, quite literally. Um, and these are what I'm going to give away. When I hit 1,000 subs, we're going to give away these 57 steam games and if i'm in a super generous mood i might also maybe you know throw in a couple extra people because i'm so happy that we exceeded the thousand maybe we hit 1250 or who knows i might just uh give away even more games but i just wanted to let you guys know these are the games that i keep bragging about or saying that i have i do have them as you can see so anyway uh, I think that's about it. Um, this, like I said, this will be at the end of another video. So I've probably already said, comment, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, check out my Discord and other channels. And uh, I don't need to say remember about the great big game giveaway because how could you forget? I just showed you every one of the games. So until next time, again, <laughs> I'll be seeing you later. Bye.